Hello everyone and welcome back to my stock career in Kerbal Space Program 1.11. In this video we are following Duna Mission 3 in its attempt to land on Duna twice and that is to pick up the Duna Stone and pick up blueberries but they're in different biomes. The blueberries are in Lowlands, Midland Sea and Southern Basin. The Duna Stone is in Eastern Canyon, Midland Canyon or Highlands. So we've got that and we also need to do science data from surface of Duna. Now our lander is sort of weird in that it's got the RCS, oh, I do have to remember that I've thrust limited that to 10%. It's got RCS no reaction wheel. So that's not great. We do have these air brakes and maybe I'll have them help with pitch and yaw, I don't know. That means it's active, right? <laughs> I always get that mixed up. Uh, so maybe that'll help with not using so much uh, RCS. Another quirk is that the pod up here is going to be basically uncontrolled because we're going to have Jeb and Bill both land and that's not ideal. So a few things that I didn't really think through very well when we launched this that may cause us problems. Right now we're in interplanetary space and approaching Duna, so let's get into Duna SOI. Okay, so we want to capture, and that's a fine periapsis since we're going to use thrust to capture. The stage delta V is not reading properly because we've got the engine plate here, and it's only reading delta V from the bottom tank adapter, so that's weird, but Anyway, we're in a polarish thing to hit as many biomes as we can. And we'll have to get Jeb to EVA out to check which biome it is. That's the only way I know how to do it right now. Oh, uh, even when turning here right now, it's using the air brakes to try and... That's interesting. Okay, capture. So, well, this is, this could, that could be a southern basin right there. Well, let's get Jeb out to see. Uh, poles still. Well, I can keep that and get that science. Okay, let's just get out of the whitish area and see what this is. Lowlands. Well, there is stuff at the lowlands. We can get blueberries at Lowlands, but this is an... I don't know where Lowlands starts and ends like this. Um, next distinctive feature, there's a basin here. Is that a basin basin or is it just like Lowlands or something? Lowlands is fine though. This is Midland Sea. Well, uh, well, there's blueberries in the Midland Sea. Okay, keep forward. Okay, well, we'll try for Midland Sea. Seems good. So we'll uh, go around and separate and then bring our orbit down. I, I want to go down decisively instead of maybe using too much error breaking on this. So we're going to point normal. Oh, we need to get Jeb uh, transfer crew into here. Having the air brakes working like that is sort of interesting. I really wish we had a reaction wheel. <laughs> um, when I say interesting, they don't actually give me much confidence that they're gonna do anything useful. Okay, so that's uncontrolled now. Okay, that's good enough. Decouple. That shroud is annoying. Okay, starting the engine. Yeah, we need to bring our orbit down. Uh, let me collapse some of this stuff, but keep this up. So that I can undo the thrust limiting if it turns out to be necessary. Okay. So, decisive burn to bring our orbit down. Really close to everything. <laughs> I think that's good enough. Surface. We'll have Jeb hold it. I've still got on the thrust limiting. We'll see. Oh, this might be overshooting it a little bit. I don't know. Hmm. 
I haven't encountered the atmosphere yet. Okay, let me retro a little bit more. No, we are in the atmosphere. Let me just deploy the brakes. We've probably done the thermometer and barometer stuff. Oh, well, okay. Well, I guess not. Not even the transmission bit. What kind of thrust weight ratio we have? Um, nearly four. No, we've got some pitch wiggliness, but nothing too serious. But we're not slowing down either. Is it orbit coming in? Yeah, I guess it is. I sure hope we don't miss the Midland Sea, but then again, wherever you land, we must land somewhere with something, right? Right? Either blueberries or the Duna Stone, hopefully. It'd be quite something if I managed to accidentally land in a biome that didn't have either. And we've got six biomes to choose from. Well, we are slowing down. Uh, we're using a little bit of Pitch Authority L. Give that some RCS help at this point. Well, I don't know. We're landing where we're landing. And I hope it's just not a horrible slope. There, there's strain scatter around, that's for sure. Uh, we're going sideways. No. Uh. Okay, we've landed. Uh, we're on that sort of slope. Let's bring in the brakes. RCS off. Okay, no, no, you can. Uh, we definitely do not want them to try and deploy when we're going up because that would cause bad drag. Um, all right, what biome are we in? First, the seismometer could tell. Midland Sea. So it is Midland Sea. Okay. Um, we've landed in Midland Sea before. Apparently. Well, we can get the recovery amount. Okay. Well, we have Bill EVA. Can Bill get that stuff? No. Let's uh, EVA report. We've landed in the Midland Sea before, apparently. Hmm. Uh, but I guess we landed in the Midland Sea, but we only had the Duna Stone contract before. Not the Blueberry contract. Big surface sample? Yeah, we've well, we didn't recover that surface sample. Hmm. So confusing. All right, crew report. Well, we definitely have landed here. Okay. Back out again. Okay, that's good enough. Should be. Take data. Let's see if we can get a new temperature. No, there's nothing new. All right. Uh, blueberries. I assume blueberries are blue. Which would sure make them stand out. I don't see anything blue anywhere near here. There's a little thing there. Oh, uh, don't land too harsh. Uh, boink. No, those look like something. That's definitely not a terrain scatter thing. Okay, well, blueberries are this kind of rock. 
I guess this is a purplish tint at least. All right. Pick up blueberries. Ford. All right. So we got those. We just need to bring them back. And now we need to rendezvous with our stage to refuel. So that's not the probe. Uh, Duna Mission 3, probably. Well, I don't know which one is... They're probably pretty close together anyway. Maybe it is the probe, because uh, I think we ended up controlling from the pod last time. When we separated, the pod was controlled first, so I think it is probe. Anyway, but they're pretty close together. Uh, we're gonna have... Oh, maybe we should wait a day. We don't have a probe core on here, so we're not gonna have electric charge loss. Best to be in line. Okay, well, yeah, let's not wait. Um, so we're getting going north-ish is what we want to do. Okay, RCS on, of course, and we've got full RCS because this is going to be hefty. And go. Okay. We need to hit a biome that we didn't hit before next, though. Eastern Canyon, Midland Canyon, or Highlands. That's what we need. I think I'm too shallow, actually. Ooh, that's more inclination than I was thinking we were going to get. Okay, which way? This way. Wow, the drag at the up in the upper atmosphere of Duna is really something, though. Look at it. We're at uh, 24 kilometers, and it's still pulling us down like crazy. I thought we easily had enough delta V to get into orbit, but so I was a little bit lax, but this is not great. Well, we'll make it, but just barely. We're gonna have to go steeper next time. Okay, making orbit. Well, that's a good enough orbit for now. I'm gonna have the stage, the transfer stage, meet up with this instead of the other way around given our fuel situation. So let me switch to that. Now it is reading properly uh, for some reason. It says on its own it's got 3,551, which I believe. But the engine plate is still there. So it's only when the engine plate is there and there's like another stage or something. Okay, we are approaching now. Okay. I think I'll use RCS here right now. Oh, that's not the most efficient thing ever. Okay, 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 okay. Maybe I shouldn't have used RCS at all. At least until the actual docking, because it uses RCS really quickly. It is still a pretty heavy stage. Okay. Let's slow down a bit. We're a little bit askew, and I can't quite see where the little RCS are puffing, so we'll just make do with magnetism as usual. And there we are. Okay, RCS off, and let's refuel. Okay, well, now we have to dare to do another landing, which is complicated. Let's undock. Given how we sort of missed last time, well, I mean, the Midland Sea, I didn't quite land where I wanted to. This is a tough thing to try and get to. Maybe over here would be better. But let's just check. So, this must be a canyon. EV report, please. Yeah, oh, no, it's Midland Sea again. Um, I was not expecting that. Didn't we just, didn't we do the EV report? I'm so confused. We did do the EV report above Midland Sea, right? Shouldn't it have asked me wh whether I was, wanted to keep the duplicate? Let me see. Um, yeah, we're here. All right, let's, yeah, let's see if this is a canyon or not. Western Canyon. That is not one of the canyons that we want. 
Well, shucks. There's a canyon that isn't the right canyon. So if that's the western canyon, this must be the eastern canyon, I guess. So we'll just wait until Duna rotates until the eastern canyon is under us. Maybe we should just try. <laughs> I think it'll rotate too far next time. And I think it's going to rotate. No, it'll, uh, okay. Um, if we add a little bit of uh, inclination change too to our retro, it'll work. So like that, and then like that. But is it going to be the right biome? I don't know. Well, that's a canyon, isn't it? <laughs> it looks like a canyon to me. It's tough to see. Well, I'll, let me see. Jeb, EVA. Don't do any... Oh, God, it's spinning. Upper at... Well, that doesn't help. Oh, I should have put the brakes out already. You know what? Can we just go back to orbit? This isn't working right. Yeah, we're not going to hit the biome that we intend. I think we're committed to landing, though. Oh, why is it spinning around? Um, oh, more RCS. He's out of the RCS. Well, we're accidentally landing on the pole or something. Yeah, I'm still not used to how Duna's atmosphere works. Now, somebody had said that there's a chance of finding some of the other stuff, like the Duna Stone and all, a small chance of finding them in a non-indicated biome. But uh, I don't know if we can do too much hunting for it. We'll see. Okay, we've landed. Please let me like Highlands. I mean, this sort of bump, it must be Highlands, right? I mean, let's thrust limit that. I Oh no, uh, on Ascent we still want it. That full blast. These we do not want on Ascent. And there we go. Ladder out. Alright, seismometer, where are we? Well, poles, obviously. I mean, not a huge surprise. At least the science is new. We didn't even plant a flag last time. Alright, Bill, you get to plant a flag. This one, that one looks different. That looks also too big to be a Duna stone. We'll see. Maybe it's just accidental. Anyway, take surface sample. Keep. EVA report. Keep. On a flag. Fill at the poles. Oh, capitalize poles. Whoops. Wrong biome. I mean, it looks interesting and all. Oh, we can climb it. Ow. But I think it's one of the ones that the rovers need to deal with, probably. Let's see, let's get close. It doesn't say anything. Okay. Okay, now we're on top firmly. Nope. Yeah, it's probably one of those that the rovers need to deal with. There's a thing there. Oh, there's a little guy there. Hold on. Oh, those are probably berries again. Uh-oh, I'm falling too fast. Well, that gives hope, though. They didn't say anything about berries at the poles. Oh, yeah, they're blueberries. Okay. Right, well, then maybe the other thing is... Hey, Duna Stone. Let's see... Well, we might have to run back to the lander. Yeah, I think it's another one of these rover rocks. Maybe we'll have Jeb give a try and take a look around. Wow, while we're physical time warping, look at the lander. It's sort of jittering over the landscape. When I come out, yeah, it's moved. That's not great. Oh, I'll pick up more blueberries. Why not? Okay, I think at the pole we can get blueberries even though they did not tell us that we could get blueberries at the pole. We've come to this conclusion and it's all blueberries all the way. There's actually a lot of blueberries. There's blueberries there, blueberries there. 
So many. You'd think Duna stones would be more prevalent than Duna, but <laughs> nope. Got a uh, propellant. Just run out. Ah. Okay, board. All right. So once again, we need to rendezvous, and once again, we're not in the right timing for that. So let's wait. And this time, we want to head south from here. Okay. So opposite that marker. Ladder up. RCS is on full power. SAS on and go. Uh, we don't have to tilt so much. Let's stay going up for a little while first. Last time I was too shallow. Oh, RCS on. Jeez. That was briefly very dangerous. We've overshot, but. I'm sure the stage can handle that part. Let's see how much it's going to take to make orbit, though. Okay, I mean, overall, we're doing better than last time here. And we're back down to using less thruster power. And none necessary right now. Okay, that'll do for the time being. So a little bit better on ascent this time, but not ideal by any stretch. And we need to rendezvous. Okay, so here we are back with the transfer stage. Well, the capture stage, whatever you want to call it. And we do have enough fuel to top off the lander one more time. If we play our cards right. So there's that. Okay, right, let's get rid of some of this velocity. Okay, and we've got it. Uh, nope, no RCS needed. All right, well, let's see. Oh, probably just, uh, well. We have just enough to fill the tanks over in the lander. After that, this is done, basically. Third landing. All right, can we find the right biome this time? <laughs> That's so hard. So actually, how much delta V do we have here? It's not being honest. <laughs> okay, uh, maybe 866. They could probably dock to something and get replenished, which is a good thing to try and do with it. But for now, we have to figure out where to land this. So we'll fly over it completely once. And then we'll make sure to land decisively at it the next time. Like the arc will end in it instead of going on an overshoot. See any Duna stones? Eastern Canyon. Well, so it was right. It was the right place to land, except we overshot. All right, let's not skimp on it. We're going to make sure it's in that canyon. Even though it costs a little bit more to make sure of that. So like that, and we're going to get less time to slow down like that too. It's all very harrowing. It's been pretty tight each time. I keep forgetting to do the goo. Okay, we are slowing down. Got a bit of a roll thing going. We're actually slowing down pretty well this time. I guess because the land is low, we're going through higher drag. Because we're getting to lower parts of the atmosphere. Some of the other locations were higher up. 
so not as much drag. Okay, Retro. Well, hopefully some of those are Duna stones. Okay, we've landed. All right, our CS off. Checking biome. Oh, we've got the that data. Uh, I think the other temperature scan, Eastern Canyon. All right, the other one was a zero anyway. Let me review. Oh no, that's from poles. Ah, I overwrote the poles thermometer reading. Uh, Bill, why didn't you pick up the poles stuff? Okay, well, anyway, EV report, keep. Surface sample, keep. Board, um, actually, take all. Board, crew report. Oh, finally, descending the ladder properly. Good times. Okay, up and jump, forward, up. Uh, climb okay good so take data take data board all right goo observe keep uh, the thermometer well we'll log it again barometer and seismometer okay so all that's done EVA again, Bill. Bill at the Eastern Canyon. Feeling really lucky today. Yeah, Bill's gotten all the good... And the flag fell down again. Gotten all the good gigs. Okay. Let's see if we can find something. Well... Bill's almost handling this like a pro now. Yep, yep, stood right on top of it. Pick up Duna Stone. All right, keep, and we've got it. And this still gonna be floating. Anyway, doesn't look like it. Jump and forward to the lander. Well, that was simple, finally. Come on, Bill. You can do it. You can do it. Grab and board. Bill had the best EVA approach today. All right. So now we have to rendezvous with the return capsule, not the transfer stage. Um, we're not too far off right now. And I'm sort of in a rush to get this thing done. So... Uh, we're going north east north northeast SAS on RCS on full RCS all right here we oh let's get the orbital information up go I think this will be a good ascent no 6.5. We have to do all the work this time. So that's going to be annoying. Okay, we are in a safe orbit again. So, how do we meet up with it? Here we're past its orbit, here we're below its orbit. Not the best combination. We've got this inclination. Uh, we could meet up with it over there if we did it right. It'd be easier to let it catch up with us. Because it's right behind us. And we'll actually try and arrange a meeting at that ascending node there. Okay, uh, so that's 9.8 kilometers. Should we bring that in a bit? No. Just a little bit further out will do. All right, its docking port is on its bottom. Make sure we're controlling from our docking port. Okay. 
So maybe we'll slide. Well, no, that not that way. Slide on behind it. Okay, approaching to dock. And magnetism. Okay, I think we should have Jeb EVA. Grab all the data. I mean, we should leave something for the science lab, but no. <laughs> I don't like science lab anyway. Science labs anyway. Um, we, uh, Bill, could you, you can't stabilize at all. Bill can't use the SAS. That's going to be all sorts of fun after, maybe I should have Bill go back. But what's Jeb going to do here anyway? But Bill hasn't gotten his points yet. It might be dangerous just to leave the lander without, maybe Jeb will be our permanent Duna lander guy. Mm, which is more irritating to not have SAS on. <laughs> Uh, a re-entry vehicle is more irritating. Okay, Jeb, you got to go back. Take data. All right. So all of it's going to be coming back home with Jeb. So Jeb better survive. Grab. And board. Eh, uh, yeah. We got a duplicate thermometer reading. I'll leave these two connected for now. And we'll wait until it's a transfer window back to Duna before separating them but well success for now we got our duna stone and blueberries we just need to bring them back and we got scientific data from the surface of duna uh, i guess i should just transmit uh one example of it let's see um no let's keep that this one is just uh same for recovery and transmission so transmit oh no com devices Right, the transfer stage had all that. Okay, just keep everything. We'll just have to recover it all. Okay, so that'll be it for this video. Next time, I'll endeavor to bring this and the space plane back, and we'll see what happens. So with that, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below, and I'll see you next time.